We recently marked Veterans Day with a number of community tributes. For one veteran in Brooklyn Park, his tribute came early in the form of a trip that he calls a life-changing experience. The flight took off at 6 o'clock in the morning and we returned about 10, 20 at night. Roy Whitney remembers the trip like it was yesterday. It was a trip of a lifetime. This is my hat from, from the service. The Korean War veteran and resident of St. Therese at Oxbow Lake visited the nation's capital in September. I do have a, a bunch of memorabilia. One of them was the t-shirt that we all wore. He and dozens of other Minnesota veterans received an all-expense paid trip funded by the Honor Flight Network. It gives veterans a chance to visit memorials that they would never have a chance to visit. Each veteran could take a loved one on the trip. Whitney chose his daughter, Sandy. And I asked her if she wanted to go as my guardian. I couldn't hold her back. <laughs> she was very excited about it, and, and I was too. And we had a great time. En route to D.C., Whitney opened letters thanking him for his service. One of them came from a fellow Oxbow Lake resident who also served in the military. He said this is the first time he's used two-star stationery since he retired, and I thought that was pretty great. For Whitney, there was one memorial that stuck out. We ended up at the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier at 5 o'clock for the changing of the guard. That was very, very emotional. Whitney says he will be forever grateful to everyone who made the trip possible. It was all in all a very educational, fun, emotional trip. I wish more veterans had the chance to go on this trip. In Brooklyn Park, Abdi Mohammed, CCX News. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.